Today I'm going to be talking about a big problem in crypto that has been emphasised by the recent crash and it's a lesson actually that I've, I've posted in my new community uh, and I'm going to give you guys access to this particular lesson but before we get into that I just wanted to let you guys know that not only have this is now launched and it's it's going well it's in its early days but because I'm going to go away for a few days I want to build it as quickly as I can so it's already at a good price but if you if you go into the description you'll find a link uh, just copy and paste that and you'll get an additional 20% off the pre-sale price I'm not gonna have this live for very long um, but yeah I just want to kickstart it I've got some good great guys in there already um, but you know the sooner we get off to a, a flyer with more people in there it'd be awesome so yeah it's a bit of a no-brainer really anyway that's the plug for that let's uh, get on and I'll show you this lesson and you can get a feel for if this is something you know you'd like to be part of all right cheers hey guys I thought it'd be good to have a bit of a recap now on step five and today's step is going to save you thousands I can assure you and I'm going to show you why uh, good evidence of a recent problem so the first step was obviously about getting you set up and detailing you know exactly where you want to be spending the money that you're going to um, make from this bull run important to be absolutely focused then we talked about mindset you know you got a lot out of that not talked about that often but absolutely key two books this is of course about treating it as a business not just watching YouTube videos or whatever your in information sources going in one ear and out the other so input output I know Dylan's been doing this a lot and it's paying off for him big time so I recommend you do that obviously the same applies to what you get out of this community yeah then we talked to interesting one this one then we talked about crypto youtubers and um, the absolute ones you should be avoiding at all costs you'll get wrecked to the actual really good ones and again we've, we're limited on time aren't we so you want to treat it as business and spend it listening to the right people that are actually going to benefit you instead of the same regurgitated shit or quite frankly dangerous information so I was watching a bit of this live stream and I want to bring this to your attention I cannot cash out from Coinbase and then he goes on about his balance and this is obviously on the day of the crash and this not necessarily the zero balancing but exchanges crashing when significant events happen i.e. when you're most likely to want to go into an exchange to either buy or to cash out you can't yeah I've experienced this myself so and it'll cost you thousands if you're not careful so you don't want to be relying on just one or a handful of exchanges this is about on and off ramps okay now of course in the UK they're fucking is over we're restricted and to be fair you guys in the US you've got your fair share of problems as well but it's about working out which ones you can actually access and sign up to in the first place which ones have got the type of coins that you want to be buying and which ones you can actually cash out from because you can't cash out from them all so I would suggest you sign up to six minimum probably eight as people might scoff at that but you'd be surprised yeah you what's the harm so what you've got to sign up and do a bit of KYC big deal we just focus right one morning one afternoon whatever right I've done my research these are the ones that I want to get into and just bosh 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 get it done again we're treating this like a business it's a serious short-term project and it? it's gonna change your life so I've heard good things about cracking I'll be signing up to that one whatever you do do not touch uphold Jesus it cost me about fourteen hundred dollars to get my uh, stuff off there robbing bastards I just won't trust them as far as I throw them avoid at all costs I think most of you are probably on Binance and even though there's this problem Coinbase KuCoin Mexi definitely so cheap 
love how cheap that place is so that's my go-to place if it's on Mexi I'm not getting shafted by fees and yeah there'll be some uh, you know there's some other ones but like I say when you're on uh, like coin market cap you can see where they are gate IO I've never signed up to that one that seems to appear to, should I say appear to have access to some low caps um, buy bit uh, Gemini I think is another one I think you can cash out from that one I had a mate of mine tell me about that so yeah you need to be looking at this but not only once you've signed up to them you want to get to grips with using them and then document it so then you, you just calm and relax so when it comes it's just like okay those two options are out the window but now I have the option where I can go and do this and you're used to how its interface works but ultimately it's about whether you've got on Tangium or you're on Ledger you know you're using those so you've got I don't know USDT on there and you want to buy you know which exchange or exchanges are you go to to go and send it to or even buy it initially if you are do you know how to do bank transfers which will save you money compared to just buying it by card and it's these little intricacies that all add up I mean fees I mean ERC20 fees in the bull run they're already expensive enough yeah so what we can save on exchange fees it's just really going to add up and it's these little little twists or not twists little nuances um, and little moves that we make that will make us all more profitable and especially you won't be losing your shit like this guy um, and others that especially weren't going to be able to get access there's nothing more frustrating <laughs> and you want to buy something uh, rock bottom prices you know it's going to fly up and you cannot get access I've experienced it myself. Don't let it happen to you. Okay, guys, get this done, and um, I'll I'll see you in the next one.